The Kalpana led commission resumed sittings today after a week long recess to allow adequate time for lawyers representing various parties in the proceedings to provide more witnesses with pertinent information to tender evidence before it. Mr. Richard Honey, an eyewitness at the scene of crash, was commission witness number 61 who came to give his evidence to the inquiry team today. I would say it flew overhead insofar as perhaps at this angle above me. It wasn't behind me. It came from this side, seemed to come here, go to the right, come back again. Lawyer Fred Ngatia appearing for Saitoti family raised concern. As to the contradicting evidence by earlier presumed eyewitnesses questioning the credibility of Mr. Hani. I've cross-examined virtually uh, all the witnesses. And there were witnesses near the vicinity. You say you were, which, and I say this for the upteenth time, we doubt whether you are. And they say they were able to see the helicopter quite clearly. And to even read the belly, the belly of the helicopter. So that evidence, according to you, would be incorrect? Not at all. Why should it be incorrect? If that's what they saw, and that's what they, they've stood holding a Bible to say that that's what they saw, why can I, how can I question what they saw? I'm telling, you, I'm telling you what I saw, or in fact what I did not see, which is I did not see the helicopter. So if someone else saw it, in another, uh, maybe two, three, five kilometers away, I, that's, a, that's fine. The session became so heated at some point that the witness was almost called down to allow for verification of his statement and the crash locality, pushing the commission's chair, Lady Justice Kalpana Rawal, to intervene. Mr. Hani, after the two circles, the helicopter went towards the mast, and that is the last time before the explosion. Is that correct? That would be, that would be my recollection of the event on the day, yes. And needless to say, if that version is not in accord with what the sky truck would show, it may mean that you are quite mistaken. Of course, you appreciate you, we are all failable, isn't it? He was told that helicopter does it. So I, I really don't understand why he should be asked with that scientific accuracy, the, the, his evidence. But if you have good reasons for it, Let's do it correctly then. Proceedings continue on Tuesday at the Kenyatta International Conference Center in Nairobi. Samuel Tawish, GBS News.